Got a leak? There's lots of reasons for leaky faucets, but no matter what the root problem is, you have a leak and it needs fixing. To replace a worn washer, first turn off the water supply. Then remove the decorative cap, if there is one. Unscrew the handle and remove it. If the handle sticks, just gently nudge it up with a screwdriver. You want to be sure to wrap the screwdriver edge with a rag to prevent marring the finish. Next, unscrew the packing nut by turning it counterclockwise. A lot of older faucets have a cover over the actual valve. If that's the case, remove that too. Then, remove the valve stem from the base of the valve. It should pop right off, although some twist off. If you have a twist off that's difficult to unscrew, put the handle back on the stem and give it a twist. Now, remove the washer and replace it with a new one. Some faucets have a spring under the washer like this one. Valve washers come in many shapes and sizes. Your best bet is to take the valve stem to the hardware store and get a washer that matches the old one. That might be hard to do if the old washer is damaged and deformed. If that's the case, your best clue about the original shape of the washer is the valve body. Look for the metal opening, called the valve seat, that the washer presses against. If the side of the valve seat is angled, find a cone-shaped replacement washer. If the seat is flat, like this one, get a replacement washer that's flat. Now, just reverse the steps to reassemble. When you replace a washer in your leaky faucet, you stop the mess and save water. What could be better?